Thursday, that? March 28th. Oh, yeah. Um, so Russell's doing a shoot for his song with OMB PZ today. I've been editing visualizers. We had a call with Even today for Shantae for her new album release. And I taught Mike G how to run his offer based business. It's worth it. We outside. You want to tell them what we're doing? No. Why are you always acting like that in my vlog? Be nice. Come on. <laughs> His arm is stiff. Tell him. We outside in the warehouse with a bed in the corner. Yeah. That's why I wear the duo and he just We're outside. We're we're at <laughs> <laughs> He snapped the head of it. Tell him what we doing. We at um Cy Beck Studio currently shooting uh <laughs> Nobody Really Know with Russell and OMB Peasy. We got beds in the corners. With mannequins, green screens. We finna shoot a bed scene in the corner over there. Yeah. On the casting couch. And the, on the casting couch. With the green screen behind it. Mike G prepping for his scene. <laughs> 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 we getting busy. We'll tune in later. <laughs> Yellow, red, black. Hit up Mike G if you want some offer based mixing. Offer based Beats, offer -based mixing. Beats. Everything, on, mastering, man. offer based you vibes. Want to talk to me you want some information? <laughs> hey, if you're trying to get a feature from me, get a my GB. I might hear it, man. I might hop on. Ooh. Make it simple. Hey. Just put him G. on. We're going to have to green Wait. screen him. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Like this, like. So today we're doing offer based. <laughs> <laughs> that was actually get back. <laughs> 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 like this. Good. <laughs> you gotta put your hand in your back pocket. <laughs> no, I ain't gonna be like, oh, this nigga a little sleep. This he a little sleep. sleep. He a little different. The, the camera <laughs> angle's good, but I don't know about him. <laughs> camera good. He not. <laughs> and this is my station. This is actually a really cute set, though. I gotta finish these visualizers. Here. You didn't send me the lyrics to Bangladesh yesterday, so I had to guess them. So you should double check them. That, um, I, I feel like I got them. But when you said make these in threes, I thought you said make these in threes. And then I was like, that doesn't make any sense. Make these in threes? Yes, yeah. Make these. Yeah, in these, threes. yeah. So that's all I You ever thought about rapping, Mike G? Hell no. <laughs> I used to freestyle in high school. I was like freshman, and then like that's how I got the beats love. Cause like I really ended up liking the <clears throat> instrumentals, and then my sister got me a keyboard um, for my birthday, and then after that it was up. Oh, that's tight. Like I didn't do shit. <laughs> I was just I was in high school, and like. Like, I got, like, good grades in high school, man. I was just selling candy out of my backpack. Oh, yeah, you were one of them like, kids. Yeah, I, but I was hard with it, though. Like, <laughs> I had everything, like, candy, chips, <laughs> like, everything. Drinks, you know what I mean? Sodas, Gatorades, everything. I would True. go buy from, like, Costco and shit, Sam's Club. Mm -hmm. And just, like, you know, if you sell a pack of Skittles for, like, you know, 30 pack, it'll make $15. I bought a laptop off of that. I bought a PlayStation off of that. Damn. I bought hella shit. So oh, was yeah, you was lit. Out. Yeah. That's tight. But yeah, after my sister, she bought me a keyboard, it was up. I, <laughs> I wasn't, like, I was still going outside, but, like, not as much. I was just making beats. And every beat I made, I was like, 
this is him. I was like, this is going to go <laughs> right. Like, every next beat. Man, yeah. This is going to be the one that changed my life. Yeah. Absolutely. Now your shit changed? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. It took a minute. It took a big minute. Yeah. <laughs> and my dad pushed me to go to college my whole life. And I went to college. And um, it was like a couple months in. I, was, I remember it. Like, I was walking home. And um, I called my dad and I was like, yeah, I don't, I don't know if this is for me. Like, I kind of want to drop out. And he was like, well, like, what are you going to do? And I was like, I want to make beats. <laughs> and he was just like, Pissed. yeah, like what? <laughs> Pissed. But now he, him and my mom hella happy for me, so Aww. that's cool. That's tight. It had a happy ending. Yeah. Oh, shit. We're supposed to be getting a call about the key room for I think he's on there. The oh, that that nice yeah. If we could do things in the daytime in those cities, I prefer to do that. This is a tight shot. Yeah, exactly. So many times I was hurting. Feeling like the plan I had just wasn't working. Feeling like the things I had just wasn't working. Feeling like I couldn't drop till it was perfect. What a shame, I'm new and involved with perfect. I had love, I had faith, I had purpose. I put my heart and my soul in these verses. I see the street filled with black cars and hearses. Nigga, this a Roman 4D. I was just gonna say, all right, so a little robot. So how long did it go? Like 15. All right, so. Uh, but it's like, nigga, you gonna make that back, you. The big part at the bottom part, like, what, 10? Now that's one thing. Oh, okay. It's all, yep. This sensor could be switched out to 8K or 6K. But yeah, it's a whole a whole kit. The lens is separate, but all together is like 15 The lens, lens is what makes that motherfucker look like that, though. The sensor yeah. inside of here and the lens, yeah. yeah. And this is like a laser, so it pulls focus the whole time. All right. This is one piece to go to get that spark going because you can run that ad perpetually off that one piece. I had an ad running on a piece of content the whole year, nigga. I was getting comments. Shit started in January. I was getting comments in November. Like, nigga, this the shit. That shit ran the whole way. And it just keep building it while you keep dropping new shit on them. You run ads daily, too. Nigga, the ad, my ad budget is like, <coughs> niggas deal. <laughs> you feel me? Because I already know. Nigga, I had looked up with Google spend on ads. I was like, I need to step my shit up. No, for real. <laughs> oh, God. Because it's like, they get it. And it's like, when, when you running that ad, even when you down and you not putting out shit, you always getting a new fan. How long you been ripping? Since I was like seven. Yeah, yeah. 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 But 2018, <laughs> when I start putting shit out, yeah, 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 nigga, that ad, you never. Even if you don't put nothing out the if whole year, you running that money on them ads. Man, like, bro, nigga, that shit pay for itself. It's if fun. you could get one fan for one dollar and that nigga buy a piece of merch, you made your money back. If he come to a show, you made your money back. Yeah. If he buy a song, you made it back. Good. That ad spin is the most justifiable spin <coughs> out. Because it's like you getting a whole person who could spend money with you forever for a one time fee. Nigga, run them ads. <laughs> run, if you got a piece that's working organically, like I don't. I only run ads behind shit that yield like 40% of my followers. So I got a million. So if it hit 400,000, I'm running the ad. If it don't hit under that, then I just make something new until it breaks that threshold and then I go. My only thing with the label is just like every time we get in them dealings, it just feel like it be in the way of my motion. Like having to slow and do the six months, like yeah, fuck like Man, it don't work. It don't, like, like it don't work music. for like, a nigga like me, because it's like, bro, I'm trying to, when I make something I love, I'm trying to get it out. And I'm trying to make some shit and make it go. I don't want to wait six months. I'd rather roll it out after it's out versus trying to build it for six months and then drop it. That shit backwards to me. I'd rather drop it and then let's drop all the content after. If they go back to it, great. You feel me? But it's doing like, that weight, like bro. Build, it's like you building a, a Starbucks nigga in the, a country for some projects or something. You just build it. You don't know what you build it for. Like, it's like selling a bunch of Starbucks cup and you don't serve coffee. Here, this cup, though. Right. Right. And I can't put nothing out. 
you're not giving me a chance to even make somebody become a fan. Exactly. If yeah. I put shit out all the time, you mean like, like they like Starbucks over this motherfucker. Nigga. Yeah. <laughs> Bro, I, I push it out every, we just push it shit everywhere. It don't matter what it is. I got an album dropping every month. Like, I'm making music I love. You feel me? So if I make something I love, share that motherfucker. You should have it wait because it's like, Bro, a song might not pop to a year later. But let that shit be out there so when a nigga find it, it got the chance to. Man, you know, uh, what I realized is like, the one thing that should have never changed through my process was how I used to move in high school. You know, when you when you in school, man, you'll make some shit, that shit going straight up. As soon as it's done, it's like, nigga, we upload this bitch. Yeah, never lose it. Right Bro, never yeah. lose that energy. Yeah. That, that shit still today, like, you only get to become a nigga favorite artist if you giving it to him. Like every artist who had their era, it was the niggas who were putting that shit out. Somehow now they convinced us to not share music. Everybody fake And it's like, nigga, it's the same thing, bro. Like if Steph Curry only balled every 12 games, we'd be like, nigga not impressive. Yeah, but when yeah, you yeah. do some shit every night, every time a nigga see you, he like, nigga, bro, you got him. And they, they done slow niggas motion, bro. It be a whole year, and niggas put out seven songs in a year, 12 months, seven songs? That don't make no sense. No. <laughs> nigga, that do not make no sense. We be having this talk. <laughs> There's no way you can convince a nigga that that makes sense, but it they convince niggas, niggas, niggas that. A lot of niggas don't put out a lot of bullshit. Yeah, that's another thing. And that's like why about. my my rule is like, if I don't love it, I can't yeah, share it. If I don't it. get that feeling, like, every yeah, artist know that feeling. Exactly, and if it don't give you that, don't share it. But it's like the more the more you make, the more shit you gonna get that give you that feeling. Eventually, it's like, bro, that shit just start flowing. But yeah, niggas put out bullshit, and that's what fuck it up. But when the niggas who don't who really make that shit start putting out as much of our shit as they put out the bullshit, man, nigga. <laughs> so many niggas is fans of you, and they want to rap, but they'll never understand the game because it don't come from a nigga who. They relate to, but when y'all start sharing it too, and having these combos, bro, it change everything. Not real talk. Everything. That's the only reason niggas end up in bad deals, cause it's like nobody we don't know, get nigga nobody. Don't like, nigga, say some shit like what I said. Nah, I ain't no, for real. Right. Hey, you know it's hella funny. We be places and they be like cut the camera, and I be like, no, nigga, cause no, them man. the moments that like that's what help niggas. If you like, feel like you should cut the camera, you should be filming. That's what we told him when he first started docking. We like, if you uncomfortable and you feel like you should cut the camera. Like wild ass shit though. Nigga, good. Good. Niggas like, nigga, no, I'm unfilled. We, only thing we doing is saying the shit that niggas thinking and they don't say it. Right. But we, nigga, we just say it. And make them love you more. Part yeah. Game is part game <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Nah, that really. And, bro, that is such a perspective to share, nigga. Oh, yeah. Bro, that's such a perspective to share. And not giving up. Yeah, I did right. Now, my comments is. Nigga, that's the perspective to share because niggas don't understand. Like, when you a young nigga coming up and you rapping and then shit blow for you and you come in front of the block and niggas start coming with offers and paperwork, bro, that's a whole experience that. I'm keeping it honest. Nigga, I don't that shit ran. about no motherfucking paper. Y'all come with that chick. I don't know. On God. <laughs> and that's what fucked me up. I'm like, oh, when I start right? getting old, I'm like, Damn, I was young and I ate it like You know what's crazy man. though? You could always Shit, work your way right. out a bad deal. You yeah, feel me? Yeah, yeah. yeah. You can all, you can all, dollars. right? But that's like, <laughs> we bought nigga, that's the perspective to share. Cause it's like when niggas start hearing that side from the niggas who actually experienced it. I can't tell that story in a way like this, bro. I can get over here. I'm a man. Talk about that shit early, Fuck that nigga, man. <laughs> oh, my wife, nigga. That was going on, bro. That's how it goes. Took advantage of a young brain. You know what be crazy, <laughs> though? Hey, you know what be crazy, <laughs> though? The niggas who be doing it don't know either. That be the cold part. Like, I seen a uh, Birdman interview, and, and bro was like, man, what's up with, like, everybody saying you ride them on the club and all this shit? And he like, nigga, I didn't know. And when I meet, when I be meeting these niggas who like the niggas who sign in these and give them deals, and I had a combo with them, it's like, damn, like you don't even know, they don't even know. That we, we had that conversation. Had that conversation. Like, they don't, it don't like even, it don't even be malice, bro. It don't even be malice. Like niggas really be in their own world and ignorant to it, like you know ignorant in the truth. fuck me up, cause I got, I got morals and shit. Damn, yeah, and this certain shit I be standing on when I fuck with somebody. It's like, alright, we have a business conversation. I right, we have a business concept, but when we like, all right, we kicking it, we getting thrown together and shit, like, that would be fucking me up. 
right. and this ain't that, you feel me? Right. You know what I'm saying? So but like niggas, you look, said look, 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 look. I, I said that to say this though, you feel me? You look at the paper and shit. Like birthday gifts on this motherfucking shit right. like this. Right. So that'll make me say fuck you. He ain't just about to finish right. like you got me fucked up. But now you playing on my you feel me? Right? You ain't even just finished. Bruh, like it really, it be personal to them, but not personal to you. Like, niggas, um, niggas only know what they know. And it's a lot of times in my life, I thought a nigga was doing something to me, but it was like, he was just doing something because that's what he knew. You feel me? And it don't be a personal matter of it, it's just, it's a display of character, right? And after that, you gotta determine whether you split or not. But some niggas don't even know it's wrong because that's how they was done. If you look at their original contract, you'll be like, no fucking way. Yeah, yeah. When you look at them niggas' original shit, they think what they gave you a blessing <laughs> because they don't know. Birdman said he went to the label with all the artists and told them what's the best deal I could get him. And they told him, this is the best. And that's what he believed. It fucked me up too though, cause it's like, all right, just like bro, just see. All right, we learn it by getting fucked over. So when you, all right, you, 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 you mature now. So you don't know, so you just doing the thing. You like, all right, they did it to me, so I'm gonna do it to them. I ain't going for that. Right. Mama, I ain't right. going for that. You know, that you would think logically at some point that's how it worked. Yeah. But when you, nigga, think about our parents. Our parents been doing some of the same things their entire life because eventually it's like the desire to know better don't never kind of click. It's just like, nigga, this is what I know. And I'm not that trying to learn nothing new, because this is what I know. What, what kind of food is it? How you doing? Like, what would you do for the same, like a Filipino, like, soul food? Yeah, exactly. That's exactly what you should Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Ooh, this is nice. This is cute. <laughs> This would be fire for a visualizer. This tight. Yeah, this is set. Y'all kill them visualizers. Like, people, I'll pay for it. Nigga, easy. Easy. LaRusso, fuck I look like? Oh, with the chest, boy? I don't even know that shit yet, but yeah. People don't be having no vision, man. You know it. You trying to get busy? You're not trying to get busy. He said, he said no. <laughs> he wanted to get cooked right before he filmed. It's crazy. Y'all try to math, y'all try to 
Yeah, I'm gonna fuck around and find out. Yeah, but the uh, slap your mama on the chicken me. What's the slap your mama? Right here. Yeah, you can. Slap yeah. your mama. Not to slap your mama. <laughs> Make you want to slap your mama. Hello. And then I put that shit down too. Welcome to the life, Mike G. Welcome to the life, Mike G. I got my first three pair of socks. <laughs> <laughs> oh, over. I like it here. They treat me well. I love it here. <laughs> yep. I made all the plates. Yep. All the plates. Oh, you heard. Yeah. Look at uh, Chucky Wing. Look at him. Slap your mama. There you go. <laughs> Make you want to slap your mama. There you go. Y'all don't understand. I just had this shrimp from here. I'm going to put it. You, you already know. I'm going to put it in the bottom. But this is hella good. Y'all here though? Good to see you, bro. Come on. Oh, wait. You can't beat it, bro. It'd be real good. I'm the only one that already can get stupid. Yeah. But it'd be like, nigga, nigga, just want to show niggas love. That's it. We're gonna fuck around and find out. Damn, I'm sad so right now here. She loving you. We thinking of you. You don't even tell her we went here. <laughs> you about to pretend to find out? <laughs> What's this spot? They're gonna be like, Flowers, welcome back. What? Who are you? <laughs> Where's that girl you were with last time? <laughs> oh, yeah? You get in trouble still? Fried chicken, bussin'. Shrimp, bussin'. Boy. Oh, man. The gravy. That turkey wing with that gravy? Oh, man. Let me try some of this gravy. I might. I'm the best right here. Man. <laughs> Is it famous? Mm-mm. No, they didn't. Mm -hmm. You don't like it? Leave it's like, mm hmm, mm hmm. I was in like, mm hmm. Oh, I was gonna say, shit, leave mom for me then. I'm gonna keep fucking around. Just find it out. <laughs> nigga, what you Nigga just said, I already fucked around. I'm just. <laughs> nigga, I said, mm hmm, mm hmm, and everybody looked up. <laughs> <laughs> Who goes there? She's lying. Oh my god. <clears throat> these, these noodles? Oh my god. The noodles? Boys, grab and go. Anything you want to say to the people about this meal? I'm grateful. D boys, grab and go. On me. We in a V. Springs Road. I'm home. <laughs> Gutter butter. I'm home. I ain't gonna lie. Flavor level. These niggas getting like a nine out of ten for real. Okay. Yeah, I'll take some napkins. It's like, it's so rich in flavor, each bite. Yeah, I can see that. Man, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I'll take ice water. Ice water too, please. I was just about to ask, she on top of it. Oh my God. Wait to get to this shrimp again. <laughs> yeah. I'm out on this fucking little baby because I'm on my own feet. That motherfucker look good. Who shot that? Who shot that? Who shot that? Who shot that? When you show up and you just on the TV. Wow. <laughs> Let's go, Romeo. <laughs> yes, sir. You put all your clients on speaker, or I'm just special. <laughs> I was like, oh, he's calling me.
Yeah, answer, answer. So I was like, that's hella tight. That's <laughs> fire. Um, but yeah, just wanted. I, I honestly just wanted to call and tell you that news. About wow, how did you land that? Bro, it's those many conversations. I love it. We just been building. It's all aligning. A lot of building. You know, something six times. So a lot of conversations. A lot of building and meetings and us continually send, sending them things of what you're working on and and yeah so they want to do it uh I'll, I'll get more details soon um so i'll send it over they obviously want to work on sending the time this year to have you come to dc to do tiny desk i love it i'm ready uh but yeah that was it man so uh, I mean, once i get more details i'll i'll send it soon Jeez. Golden egg. I love it. I'm ready whenever. I'm going to keep on working and building. And when the line is time. Let's go. Yeah. Big forefront. Big Austin. You heard? You know what the fuck going on? Big Austin, not the little one, nigga. <laughs> All right, brother. All right, bro. That's dope. Right? NPR. What the fuck? Nigga finna get a two hour medley. Oh, come on. Oh, it's Saturday, March 30th, 117. We're shooting visualizers today. We got Splash in the back being nosy. Kyla Russell. Put that shit on today. Shout out to me. Got Mike G in the back. Popping his collar. Haram. Indeed. That attitude don't look good on you. Get his name right. <laughs> <laughs> We're outside. <laughs> oh yeah, this is fire. It's giving. Came up. I want to give you whole outfits. You like, give me a wear them half and half. I gave you such pants. Wow. I gave you such pants. Wow. It's like you, hey. you, you could have been. Lomo B. Who you know better than Russ? Riddle me that. Anesthesia were wrong. The feeling's back. You some I got a bite now. I can't fuck with you. I got a tight now. Mm -hmm. And have her meet, like have her be right there. And then you meet her right there. I'll start there. Wrap some of the verse. And then she come dance her through. And then kind of follow her. Into a progression in front of this gray, she could do her thing for a bit, then let me come back in and we go walk it down. Yeah. No. So after we work that area with you, she's gonna come dancing across the kitchen immediately. Her, what's here? Let me let me see how long how long this is. Hey. Yeah, start up, Splash. It was the windows. Hey. Figure out your f stops, cause the at the top is way it too bright. It was me, exactly. And DTB, five to three, locked in on weed. On D and D, bitch, don't call me. I ride around phone, went to sleep in the car. Had to recharge before I give him the bars. To there you go. Now nah, you're good. I'm up, let's make slap. It's 2023, I'm bringing the bay back. The new in the bay, I grew in the bay. <laughs> See you in the way. How you gonna win if you only shoot a few every day, huh? You won't. I see it on stones, don't hide your head. Bossing over plate with a penne noodle. Walking this bitch. Oh, really, boy? I need a team in a V. Bitch, leave it alone. I'll leave it to me. Why would I fly with this money outside? Rush hour. Niggas acting funny outside. It was 05 going down.
dummy outside when you having it. Every day sunny outside. Rain, sleep, snow, hail. How many hours can a real nigga sell? Many hoodies have I shipped through the mail. Business is booming and life is well. Outfit two, scene two. We shot three at the last location. I had to stop filming though because I was holding the Russell's gimbal and it's hard to hold the Russell's gimbal, the phone, and the monitor, you know? It's giving what it needs to give. Mike G, go my G. <laughs> you on blues or different hues. Crank that bitch until it moves. <laughs> Nigga dancing. Stop. You should be like a half step behind uh, Splash, Mike G. You should be like a half step behind Splash. Yeah. So you're never too close. How do you want to make the progression? Oh, what if they walk here and then land on me? And then one dance on this side and work that in. Yep. Yep. Wait, actually. So you can walk up. Now you're good. With K? Nah, what is it? I was gonna say, could y'all have like some type of synchronized? And I don't, that's doing too much. I was gonna say, y'all could dance together here, and then you walk into this, and the other dancers here waiting on you, and y'all kind of. One on pink, one like, on yellow. Huddle, yeah, 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 one like on huddle pink. in the middle, and then one on pink, one on yeah, yellow. Yeah, yeah. Um, but it would be cool, like, if y'all niggas was like, because you know, you be hitting that. That right? shit, you know? Yeah. What's up, brother? Cool. Nia here. Yeah, you do match with the yellow. Yeah. When I meet Nia here, that's when we can do the, uh, uh, I'm trying to think of what we can do in sync to where we can get that effect you were saying. Oh yeah, we can both, we, we both, uh, 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 uh. I was so curious on what dance move he was trying to do. I'm, I'm trying to figure out, I'm like, what's the best one to get? You know I like my walk too, but it is the incline. Mm. Okay, hold on. Yep. Huh. Uh, huh. Uh, huh. Uh, huh. Uh, huh. Uh, huh. Can we do that? Splash is gonna be going this direction. So if you're following him, you need to be on this side of him. So you don't end up in his way. Not you, Mike G. I like a pretty little thing. Yeah. Yeah. You still over here. Yeah. Hold me up. I'm on the there you go, yup. This tight. I'm the greatest. Like whatever. Like, yep. And then you know, so once I'm here, we all come in. Number three on Spotify, too. Yeah, boom, 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 not boom, boom, boom bap. Already? It's trending I, on Instagram, I too. I think it's because it bases on how fast it's getting mm. the plays. Like the amount of plays is getting. Damn, Mike G. What's wrong with you? All right. Mix oh, that bitch. <laughs> 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 Hold on. That nigga said.
Crate that bitch until it moves. Go get him. Go get him. Hey. I might be. He's the latest. Hey. Go low. Yup. On back. This real rap. Slaps. Boom, boom. Not boom, back. This a hot air balloon, we going up. Three, two, one, I'm going up. Boss, the bottles are slow, they slowing up. Really hey, go, up. go, 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 go. I can't lose. Ooh, oh my like God. On blues, all different hues. You make that bitch until it moves. Back. On fact, this road ride slaps. Boom, boom, not boom. <laughs> that was great. No rehearsal? Sheesh. That was cool as fuck. I don't even know what to say. What you said that there was a little there was a second? You said it's right next to it. Yeah, that green. Right here right up here. Yep. Grab this water. Yeah, that was really good. That's a wrap. Just to start. This is just to start. All my shit talking on the mic at battles. Huh? <laughs> Y'all see it? Y'all see me? Yeah, all that battling. It paid off. It paid off. Right. And you can do it on the spot. Like, we just made some fire on the spot. You can't beat it. It's only going to get bigger. Oh, yeah. I'm excited because we did scaling with production and just, I just like to feel the energy first and after we scale it. Yeah. Oh, yeah. You on the list. <laughs> <laughs> you made the list. Oh, thank you. I see myself and my daughter. I see myself and my mama. I see myself and my daddy. Remove myself from the drama. I'm trying to help the people here. And still make it up the hill. Take care of everyone, but still recoup the deal. I'm Big Russ now. I used to be Lil. And Big Russ still alive. This shit real. That's hard, Splash. daddy proud. You execute different when you're daddy in the crowd. My camera didn't capture shit. I missed all of that. Huh? But it was hard. What? My camera didn't capture nothing. <laughs> this shit hard. I see myself and my daughter. I see myself and my mama. I see myself and my daddy. Remove myself from the drama. I'm trying to help the family heal. Yeah, whenever he low, the light leaves the mimic. Hey, heaviest the head of the niggas splitting bread. Take care of yourself because you can't make it if you dead. Could have had a donor but ate an apple instead. One step forward, boy, that's how you get ahead. Crown on the edge of my king size bed. You know that you're growing when you're turning down head. I've been growing slowly. If it was love, you never owe me. Right. This is celebration. We up, nigga. This is elevation. Album 26. They hindered my hesitation. Room full of smoke. I'm taking my medication. Out of this world is basically an invasion. Ain't really want to go. Just wanted the invitation. I made it priceless. They call it innovation. When you put some limits, you defy limitations. Life rap. This asset is not depreciating. Regret staying up all night. Yes, you really up when you reach these kind of heights. My state gate broken. We got different kind of flights. Why is every month? Cause I'm nice with the mic. Success weighing on me. Is it heavy? Is it light? Depends on the day. Depends on the night. Will I grow? Or will I die? It depends on the light. Depends on the water. Feel for your daughter. Feel for a mama. Feel for yourself. If you don't heal you, then you can't heal nobody else. 
If you running on eating, you can't feel nobody else. Eating how you eat ain't gonna kill nobody else. How you feel about that yellow building across the street? That door hella hard. I have no opposition to it. But like the yellow and the blue are like good in contrast. Yeah. Do one more? Yeah, because I was two, right? That was just one. That was two. Oh yeah, because we did the one yep. in the corner. Let's do it. There's a good call on the jeans. They make your ass look nice. <laughs> That's going in the vlog. <laughs> Now he's leaning on the door though. <laughs> A child. <laughs> you finna break your door. This nigga is a kid. <laughs> That's the shit I'll be doing. I'm glad you're not alone. Glad you're not alone. Pocket tubes y'all got lying around for sale because mine is till May. <laughs> right. <laughs> but um, you know, we were chopping and he was like, bro, the team thinks the world of you, and I'm really grateful that like, you're a true artist. And it was like dope. Oh, it just washed away all that. Like, am I giving them enough shit? Cause it's like clearly, you know. Bro, you give more than any artist. Bro, when I saw that whole thing laid out about the Seattle thing while we were in Seattle, like you gave them hella lead way. You gave them hella lead way. And it's like, I'm gonna give you a lot of work, but I'm gonna give you quality every single time. I'm still gonna give you song breakdowns. And you never used to do that. Like you're going above and beyond. Right. I'm just not giving the time. But yeah. I'm making up the time with quality. all the content, everything. Yeah. And you're very intentional with the, it's not like you're just dumping a bunch of songs on Like you still give them everything they need to work the song. Right. You're just not giving them the time in between. And it's proven like, bro, you don't really need that amount of time. I feel like they need that time because it takes an artist four weeks to respond with a song breakdown. Right. Like it takes them all that time to get all the information that they need to work it. Yeah, it's really dope to hear. I was like, man, that's great. And I feel like it makes it fun for them because they don't really know what it's gonna be, how it's gonna look, what kind of music it's gonna be. It's it's been range. Right. Hey Russ, you know it'd be hard <clears throat> if you work with uh Nick Nack. The producer. Uh, we had an interesting experience with Nick Nack. Oh, okay, okay. <laughs> <laughs> but Nick Nack do Nick Nack do got <laughs> some of that shit, but he uh he turned. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He be diddy turn. Yeah, he be diddy turn. Whoa, shit. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh, shit. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, no. Never mind. That it's nigga Nick Nack said, you ever seen, like, you know, one of, like, a young thing, and you just like, man, I can't wait till you no, turn no, no. 18. He, he said, you ever see a 16-year-old, no, he said an age. He said, you ever see a 16-year-old and be like, damn, I, I can't, can't wait till you turn 18. That's crazy. Hell no. <laughs> what? Damn. First I met Nick Nack once, and he made, like, the hardest beat ever. That was like the only time I met yeah, him. Yeah, he, he, he be making that shit. He but, just, yeah. That was just like a throw off. It was like, yeah, uh, for sure. Mm, That's crazy. You're already white. <laughs> Strike two. <laughs> like, it's like, I, that's two quick ones where, you know, I'm already iffy on white friends. Damn, so I got a strike? No. <laughs> Until you do, but the soon as you do something, you get two strikes instantly. Yeah. So you start with zero, but oh, okay. if you do something, it's like, yeah. well, you got to get two because you're white too. That's already That's a risk crazy. on me. We get, we get These stars. Are reparations <laughs> <I haven't laughs> the warning stars. Oh it's like you cool, and then you did something. It's like you do something, and then you did it as a white man. So it's like, right? Yeah. Fuck. That's crazy. <laughs> <laughs> But yeah, that was yeah. the craziest statement. Who I've else heard. said that? It was, they was like, you got to get in with Nick Nack. It was like, mm. I feel like a few Sam. People. It was Sam. Sam. Yeah. Yeah. Sam. And he was like, the producers that you need to work with. 
Every time yeah. niggas say it too, we all be like, mm. talking about wops. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Well, about that one. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah. I feel like you kind of uh, occupy a good space in like that slap lane because every yeah. time you play a beat, like it got that energy that a knickknack would give. Yeah, but knickknack, you be having like, like game. Game yeah, it'd be beats. weird ass sounds yeah. in that motherfucker too. Well, like I tried you it too. You did that on slipped on a pill. Yeah, like that. Yeah. That was tight. But it, that's like trial and error beats. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Keep on trialing and but, keep erring. Yeah. That's so dope though that you 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 so willing to share light. Right. Yeah. Put other niggas on and shit. But yeah. while you here, my G, you got a chance to do a hundred of them things with me. Man, bro, I'm ready. Oh yeah, yeah. I really like that Bruce Leroy we did. That shit. I ain't even listened to those since we made them and them motherfuckers was hard. Yankee. Uh, damn. I don't even have them. Because we made them and now I was going to sleep. I don't, I don't even know. remember what the fuck. I remember I said, whoa. <laughs> you did. <laughs> I, was I forgot about that. And went to sleep. Nigga did that and went to sleep. <laughs> he he told me, he's like, me. don't play no more beats. <laughs> <laughs> and we got that Kid Hazel pack. Yeah. I got I got hella beats. I got hairy shit. I got hella beats. Okay. That's why it becomes so hard to remember all these fucking songs. Lex. Oh man. Oh my God, bro. The Lex Luger pack, stupid. And by the time I touch them, we gonna have new ones. We gotta just link up and, and work together. You know, as a producer, bro, like that makes any type of like trap or anything like that. You know. 90% to 99% of us. Yep. That was our first drum kit. Yep. Mine Lex too, nigga. Kit. Yep. Yep. Oh, my God. Them hi hats was the best. It was the like. 808s was stupid. <laughs> bro, you had like yeah. six downloads of the Lex Luger trying to and find Lex, the one. <laughs> Lex had that fucking, um, the Ike. Ike. Yep. The book, yep. nigga. That little box. Yeah. We're going to Komodos. Yeah. Yep. Mm-hmm. That boy Lex Luger. Crazy. Yeah, Lex did. He had his. I can't wait to get with him because it's like we gonna send it back because you ain't really been hearing his name. Yeah, I got it. But you got Together. I've never seen this. That boy Nemo badass hit that boat. Aww. Well, this is his house. He got a mansion. Pretty ass big. That's crazy. He got two mansions. <laughs> That's the Disney money. I'm seeing you. We're back. <laughs> We're gonna watch the Seattle Dog. <laughs> it got hella quiet. Hold up, my. Oh, we're gonna watch the. Don't tell anybody, especially not Kuja. Oh shit. He got a deuce. You oh, see him with the deuce? He got comey at counter. Right, and he never sees Davidson. I don't drink, but just you know for the guests. You got a whole drink area. He said for the guests. That whole fridge room is full of drinks. Whatever you want, they send it. You got Tracy. Yeah. You know, on the way here, I was like, I hope Pop's got Capri Sun. Yeah, it's just yeah. everything. There's food on the counter, barbecue on the counter, bro. Cheese. I'm about to start pulling up. <laughs> Wow. Oh, man. I got my food table, 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 table. No, you're they, gonna get a. They, yeah, they're doing the floors first. In that other room? Yeah. Nice. And so they're doing the floors down that little room, and then my table will be here. So I'm gonna have that to be cool. That's tight. I got a dark game. I'm gonna be on a dark game. Ooh. Yeah. You like it here? It's cool. It's quiet as fuck. I was thinking that too when I, we were driving over. I'm like, this is probably so quiet compared. Man, it's so quiet. It's pretty short. It's right in the middle. Yeah, I like that. Ooh. Feel it. Just turn it on there. 
That's tight oh, as fuck. Let me put it on my blog. Yeah, he is. He's like right down the street. Kind of right down the street. Classic. Wow. Oh, shit. Pops back in business. He's coming. He's coming out of the camera. One day, we took him. Already. Day one. Day one. We here for another 70 days. Eight days. We live. Live from the 206. Touch down. Ready to get fucked down. What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> You get bro's face in it. I blurred out the last part. I was about to be on ending. Honestly, I feel like the ending was the best. If I could have picked the ending, I would have picked that. Wow. Of course, when I grabbed the mic. Best part of the show. Of course, you know, I need to put you on my back. They was turned. Cue the playback. All right. Y'all gonna see. 